Welcome to WDW Insider Update, where we talk about all the latest updates in the world of theme parks. If you're new to the channel and like what you see, hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon to be notified when we upload a new video. Five years ago, an announcement was made that Disneyland Paris would receive a whopping $2.4 billion to undertake a grand expansion and transformation of Walt Disney Studios Park. Fast forward to today, with Marvel's Avengers Campus up and running and construction in full swing for the Frozen-themed land. Let's peer into the crystal ball and explore what lies ahead for Disneyland Paris in the next five years. Back in February 2018, when the multi-year transformation of Walt Disney Studios Park was unveiled, the plan was to have a phased opening, starting in 2021, with the goal of completing the majority before the 2024 Summer Olympics in Paris. However, the pandemic threw a wrench into the construction timeline, pushing it beyond the usual pace of Disneyland Paris projects. Recent construction footage and aerial images from DLP Report and Disneyland Paris Works indicate that the frozen expansion around the Seven Acre Lake might not be ready for the 2024 Summer Olympics. Instead, it appears to be on track for completion by late 2024 or possibly summer 2025. Once the frozen-themed land opens, the big question arises. What's next? The original plan included a Star Wars land with a completion target of 2025 to 2026. However, hints of postponement surfaced, including the absence of detailed permits and the omission of Star Wars from marketing materials since 2019. Disneyland Paris president Natasha Rafalski mentioned ongoing work on the theme for the third land, sparking speculation about alternatives. Rumors suggest a new Star Wars attraction might be in development for Disneyland Park, potentially a speeder bike roller coaster. The rumored location is behind Discoveryland, utilizing a previously used expansion pad near Space Mountain. This coaster, distinct from Rise of the Resistance, could occupy the available four-acre plot. In a twist, Space Mountain may return to its original Jules Verne to the moon theme, aligning with the Society of Explorers and Adventurers narrative. This change could follow a pattern seen with recent re-theming of attractions, like Tarzan's Treehouse at Disneyland. In conclusion, while some of these rumors may materialize, others may not. The prospect of continued investment beyond the Frozen expansion promises an exciting decade for Disneyland Paris. Now, over to you. What are your thoughts on these rumored developments, and what would you like to see in the future of Disneyland Paris? Share your opinions in the comments below. If you enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and explore more content on our channel. I've been Liam, and I hope to see you in the next video.